Okay. Getting everything up and running. Okay. <clears throat> that looks beautiful. That looks good. And of course, I get a runny nose now. Right. God damn it, why? Every damn time I feel like something happens. I have bodily malfunctions every time I start streaming. It's ridiculous. My throat suddenly started going. Hello, Rachel. Hello, Clifford. How are you doing? Um, <clears throat> something, something happens. Right. So I need to copy that. We're going to share this out to Twitter first off. You know, just get the ball rolling. Let some people in on this. Maybe. Maybe. No. And there she is. Okay, I am just coming. There we go. Right, beautiful. Okay, that's shared out. That's looking fabulous. The stream is looking strong and healthy, just the way we like it. How are you doing this evening, Rachel? I know how Tom is doing, you know. <laughs> and I am also going to do... Apparently I'm not. Why aren't you working? I have to do it there. Okay. Um, right, I just need to do something incredibly quickly. I do apologize very quick. Okay. Okay, so if uh, Tom and Rachel wouldn't mind just dropping a message in the chat so I can see that that is uh, working. We have that up. Okay. <clears throat> so that should be done. We can take... What was that other pose that I was going to put him in? Ah, there we go. Okay, so checking his needs. So we are continuing with the Jungle Adventures Making Money Challenge. And I'm okay, and it's very important that we know how Tom is doing. Tom's fine. He's watching, like, Simpsons specials with the kids right now, so. <laughs> so I have two new moderators. Tom was always supposed to have been a moderator, but some, for some reason he wasn't, but... He has been made one now, bless him. And um, Rachel Clifford is also now a moderator who can just come into chat if if I can't handle the situation, they will block or ban, which saves me having to mess around with switching screens and things like that. Uh, we, we tend to have a very friendly group anyway. We are very lucky. Right. His needs are looking really pants. He doesn't have long left of his little holiday. He can work while he needs to pee. Uh, to, uh, sorry, shower. But peeing is a little bit different. So we're going to get him to shower and then we're going to try... Oh, 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 stop moving, stop moving. I just noticed something. Here we go. If we go up here... <laughs> We can fertilize this bush before proceeding on to our travels. What is 
So he's feeling the falls. So this is a romantic location. Terrified by vines. And grungy because he's dirty. That's not good. We, I don't know what she wants, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, so we need to make enough money that we can stay here, which is another night is 219. As we progress, I am hoping that we will get enough uh, simoleons that we'll actually start earning money. So we have this bush here. Um, this has some really interesting fruits on it that come only with Jungle Adventure. So that's exciting. I love the sounds of the jungle. It's so pretty. Very relaxing until you get turned into a skeleton and wet yourself. Okay, so on this, we get different types of fruits. Hey, Emma, how you doing? So we get different types of fruits on here. So you've got flutterberries, which are going to give you romantic emotions. Vimberries, which are um, energized. Merry berries, which make you happy. Mm. Focused, inspired, playful confident there we go look at that i'm well chuffed with myself <gasps> where did we get that from we have a jungle machete we have a what a watcher what this is watcher God. <laughs> a watcher relic base i'm not sure what that is that'll be interesting to find out come on headphone go back in my ear and we have a spider repellent. Okay. Um, some interesting new things that I'm not sure where they've come from. So we have several different locations that we could go through here. And there's a couple that are available to us. So we came through that one down there. We can go through that one, that one. There's one. Is there one on the other side? No. There's one down there. And then there's one right down there. So let's see which ones we can actually go through. So, oh, we can go through that one. We've got door one, we've got door two, we have door three and we have door, door. Okay, we got one, two or three. So in the chat, let me know which one should we go to? Door one, two or three. <laughs> oh, decisions, decisions. Oh, what's that? looking a bit quiet at the moment that's okay though um okay i will have to pick one let's go for door number one we're going to clear with the machete which is mean we're not going to get sore hands I think we're going to door one. <laughs> we might be going to door one. Who knows? And we'll see what's through there. Hopefully we can get something good because we really need the smolians. I think door one might lead to where I turned into a skeleton the first time. So that could be interesting. Oh, door three is you got three babies. Okay. We can do that. One, two, and three. There we go. Let's clear that with the machete. I'm going to see if I can um, get the time lag down a little bit more in the, for the next stream. Oh, I love hot chocolate. Oh, hello. I pinged it myself. There we go. That was also why it took me so long to see that message because I was on the wrong stream set. That's okay. Come on, dude. You can get through there. Let's do it. 
Okay, I wonder what we're going to get through here. I don't think I've ever been through this door. Carnivorous finds. Okay, so we had this the last time. Last time we said leave treasure. This time we're going to go for retrieve the treasure. <gasps> Some eating plant. Okay, that sounded good. So, uh... Angelo has heard rumours of some eating plants, but has never seen one in real life, according to his, his <laughs> horticultural um, knowledge. The plant stuns the victim using a poison gas released from the tip of the vines. Angelo carefully avoids the dangerous area of the plant the treasure is his uh would you like to send him to the temple okay we would woohoo oh minty hot chocolate oh yes now that that's good oh okay so we got a oh my god It's 10,000 simoleons. A Celticali <laughs> jeweled calendar plate. A jeweled calendar plate worth 10,000. Holy sugar. That's, that is what we've needed. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, so we got straight through to a temple. We don't have long left of our vacation, so I don't know whether or not to sell it now so that we know. And Rachel, if you could use your mighty powers, could you ban the user? Because that is a bot. Anything that comes up like that is a bot okay so we have this temple area so this is our first temple so if you click on the name you should have special options pop up for you as you are now a moderator see if this works if you can't do it then i've got my phone in front of me let me know and i can sort it out Okay, so we have this. Oh, look, we can see down there as well where we just were. That's really cool. Oh, wow, we can see all the other locations as well. Ooh, down there looks interesting. Oh, my God, I had no idea you could do that. Thank you so much, Rachel. Okay, I'm guessing you did it anyway. <laughs> Okay, we have this beautiful uh, temple. We're gonna start at the top and work our way down. So we have nothing in there. Oh, we've got a pile to excavate. Perfect. Um. Where are you? There you are. Here he goes. He's going to excavate his... Uh... No, you're not. You're like, no, save me a smell. No. No. Bad sim. <laughs> Back up those stairs and excavate it. Thank you. Here we go. We got this. In... We got this. This is happening, guys. Oh, I can hear fire. I don't know if you guys can. It's quite, it's quite quiet. It's, it's just there in the background. Um, that's going to be fun. Okay, so that is that level done. There's nothing else in there other than it being uh, very pretty. Oh, there's the fire. Okay, this is where it could all go wrong. Are we ready for this? Because I'm not so sure I am. Um, okay, anything to harvest? Oh, harvest? Oh, yes, please. Are you hungry? You're getting hungry. So some berries would definitely come in handy. Let's get him to have a little munch on some avocados. 
Yum, yum. What was that? Oh, bananas. Ooh. Gotta love some bananas. Okay, and... I don't, we can turn that off by doing things. So let's examine it first and see what it tells us. Who's ready to die? Yay! <laughs> I feel like it's going to happen. We have 109 out of 1 million. I'm not convinced we can do this. However, we did get the plate worth 10,000 simoleons, which is pretty damn impressive. He just learnt the handiness skill. That's pretty good. That that is a thing. Yes, I... Is there people here? I'm sure I heard of a sim. <gasps> Hello? Hello, Temple Guardian. How do you do? How you doing? We can be friends. You don't have to kill us. No, you don't. <laughs> we want to be friends. Please be friends with us. I probably should have done a respectful introduction. It's mostly just your voice, not really game audio. Ooh, okay. Uh, game audio. Let's, let's just do that. Hopefully that's a little louder for you guys. Um, praise vampire lifestyle. Something tells me it's not a vampire. Um, I'm just going to see if I can turn it up here for you. No, wrong one. Wrong button. Did the wrong button. I just don't want to deafen myself, but I really would like you guys to be able to hear some of the cool sounds that happen. Uh, how's that, guys? Okay, so An Angelo figured out that some of these triggers won't work to unlock the gate, but that doesn't rule them out and... Jello could try his luck by activating a trigger or keep examining the mechanisms. Okay, let's get him to... I know you really want to shower, but why? Okay, so we know that's a no. We know that's a no. That's a question mark. So we're going to go with the question mark because it's not the other two. <laughs> I do like that it tells you that it's it's quite handy. Phew, Angelo has gained some handiness skill for narrowly avoiding a disaster. Okay, but that doesn't really help us because it didn't get rid of the fire. Let's see if this one will uh, do anything for the fire. We really don't want to die. It would be really bad. Really, really bad. <laughs> we're not going to get a million smolians if we're dead. Come on, Angelo. We know you can do this. Maybe. Our fingers are crossed. Rachel, how are you currently getting on with your money-making series? Uh, game. Here we go. All right, you examine that. Let's see, is he going to... Oh, he got a Chaos Relic base. Oh, there it is. I'm wondering what they're for. I have no idea, so fun. <laughs> Everything here will end up on my website, gamingwithshar.com, where there's tutorials for all things Sims related. Okay, so awesome. We got a no, a no, a question mark, and a thumbs up. So let's reach into the sun glyph hole. Go on, stick your hand in the sun glyph. Oh, yay! Angelo has been imbued with the blessing of the ancients. This joy is infectious and can spread to others that Angelo comes in contact with. I love the skeleton thinks you stink and it doesn't have a nose look. That's just how badly he stinks. Stop trying to leave. We're not going anywhere, dude. 
we're not it's just not happening let me go down the stairs i don't want to like spoil it by jumping down the level um i do think we're gonna have to sell some stuff fairly soon just so that we've got enough simoleons okay so we are in the next area and let's like just try and travel so we don't ruin anything there's nothing there there's something excavate that um excavate that um oh hello you okay let's examine this and see what happens <laughs> We've got this. He's not going to die. I have already lost track of how many times I have said that. We are not going to die. We will not die. Okay. Nearly there, dude. Alright, so we've got 61 and 62. So that's pretty good. And then we have to examine this and see if we can get through. I haven't played my game for a bit, but I have found some cheats for Arthur and he is making a mega mansion now with the money cheats. You've told me and more objects, etc. Yeah, so um, there's a objects cheat you can use, which is bb.show hidden objects, which will show you all of the debug options. Just be careful, there's some pretty horrific things in there. Um, considering it's base game. Okay, we're nearly there. Come on, dude. Tick, tick, tick. Come on. Yay. Oh, no, it's ending soon. Okay, um, activate. Oh, we're going to have to look at it again, unless we just want to risk it. <laughs> Uh, we don't want our vacation ending. How much is all our berries worth? Anything? No. They're not worth it. Um, oh, let's do it. We're going to sell the plate. Oh, I can't believe it. 10,000 simoleons for this one plate. That's crazy. 10,000. I just can't even believe that we found it. 10,000 simoleons for one plate. Okay. We're going to sell it so that we can get more simoleons so that we can stay here for longer. <sighs> sell. Yes. <laughs> okay. Let's get him to... Oh, no. Oh, we can't do it again. Okay. We're gonna, we, we've got a chance of doing this and we've got a chance of it going so wrong. Blame, uh, blame for temple dangers, compliment carvings or insult. Right, let's compliment the carvings. I mean, if it's any of the options, surely it's that. You like that? Yes, okay, <laughs> oh my God, oh my God. Angelo has bypassed the temple's defenses and the gate has opened. Angelo can now venture further into the temple to find what re oh, rewards away. Oh my God, oh my God, my heart was pounding. I mean, <laughs> it could have gone wrong. Okay, what we got, we got a ream. We're going round. Do you get more money for authentications? Yes, exactly, you do. Oh, saved my game. <laughs> Thank you for that, Rachel. Um, yeah, so if you authenticate the objects, you get some more simoleons for them. But because uh, we need to earn the money, I have. that's why I didn't want to sell the, uh, the, the smaller objects. Plus, there's this crown that you can craft, but I don't remember how. So I don't want to sell anything that I'm going to need for it. Okay, so let's activate. Oh, we must be inspired, energized. Oh, those berries will come in handy. Right, let's examine these first. 
Oh, actually, let's get him to travel home because we can stay here longer now. We can head back here. We know we went through door three of the second gate. So we'll get him to head back to where he's staying. We'll sort out his needs. And then when we come back, we will be, um, fingers crossed, uh, a bit more successful. Because the worse their needs are, the less likely they are to complete certain things. Right, bed is first, I think. Let's get him to have a sleep. And when it pops up, we can stay here for a lot longer, which will be lovely. Oh my God, it's going too well right now. Okay, seven days, 1,498, oh yeah. Okay, we're never going home again. We might go home to sell the house actually, like just sell the entire thing. Um, but yeah, oh my God, that's fantastic. Yes, go pee, go shower, and then have some garden salad. Oh, actually, we could get him to travel in to the marketplace. Um, there's the authentication table down there, as well as all the things that we need to do to complete this part of the aspiration, which will be ideal. <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, he's so sad. What's this? Blessing of the ancients. Oh, he's still got that. Oh, no, chill, dude, chill. We're gonna go travel. So stroppy. <laughs> he's so stroppy, he really is. Okay, we wanna go to the bar, I believe. Yeah, it's the bar we wanna go to. And we will have everything there. Ah, oh, my backdrop looks so bare now. I've completely rearranged my downstairs living room. Um, and my bookshelf has actually gone down there. Okay, so here we have the marketplace. So for this aspiration, we have to go buy some bits from there. We have to go and buy some meals from there and we have to go and view this statue. So they're all in one nice little spot. He is hungry, so let's go and eat a Salvadorian meal. Uh, let's order some, no, not a drink. We need to order food. He is hungry. Um, Let's get some of, let's treat him. He's He's been, you know, had a really rough few days so I think he deserves something that's a little bit nicer <laughs> did you nap he slept oh no I didn't have a nap so I have this awful habit every time I have a nap in the real world uh in real life if I have a nap I rearrange my house it drives my partner up the wall you have no idea it really does drive him crazy okay while he's doing that let's get him to go and view this statue and then we'll go buy three goods from the table um it, yeah so i have had the bt guy out so we can move some stuff around and extend cord or whatever Oh, look, he seems to be enjoying that, I think. What do you think guys think? With that little butterfly fluttering behind him. Oh, very picturesque. Right, let's go and grab some water. No? Why can't I? Let me buy something, dude. Ah! Okay, we can buy some things from here. We'll buy some waterfall. We'll buy some bat bait and some spider repellent. I hate spiders, I really hate spiders. What we got over here, we've got some creepy looking dolls that we can't seem to buy. I don't know why we can't buy anything from there either. Okay, so achieve level three of the Salvadorian culture skill. Interestingly, there is only five skill levels of this uh, skill, the Salvadorian skill. 
Oh, we can purchase the archaeology table from him. That would be ideal. Um, it's how I imagine the backdrop of Encanto. Oh, yes. I love that movie. We Don't Talk About Bruno is one of my favourite songs. That and Lisa's song. Oh my god, I love that song so much. Excuse you? Why did you glow? He looked like he became God. <laughs> oh, it's a bit loud in my ear. Uh, do we? Are we in like a job? Oh, we are in a job. I forgot about that. <laughs> Oh dear. Are you alright there dude? You seem to have like stopped what you were doing. Oh my god! Why is everyone glowing? Everyone is like turning into god here. Uh, we're looking for locals. You still not watched him? Oh my god. Come over and we will watch it. It's amazing. One of the better movies that they have made for a while why are you scared okay um what else do we need to do uh examine three traps uh find an area off the path and achieve we'll continue on our adventure then he is in a pretty good mood. So, yeah, let's do that. Oh, is there anything here? Oh, that's new. Okay, it looks like another salesperson is coming over. I want that. Let me buy this stuff. Who is over here? Who's running this stall? Is anyone running this stall? Why is everyone calling him? Wait. More money and prestige, but more work should you get the promotion oh yeah if you want to um not being able to stare at oh fair enough you've been so poorly yeah make sense okay we're gonna continue with our travels then let's go and see what's what. Maybe. Okay, uh, we're gonna go up here. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I had a bit of a wobble there. <laughs> oh, I miss all my stuff for my background. It's so sad, it's all gone. Right. Okay, so we need to go through there it is. Go through the first one. Oh, we don't have to keep doing it. Okay, go through. We went. We couldn't go through there, could we? Oh, we can now. Well, we'll leave that. We'll go up here. We're gonna. I want to finish that temple. I'd like to get through all of the temples. just running 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 and then we went through uh one two and three there it is yes perfect okay he'll be there in no time <laughs> A very quick run through, but yeah, I want to finish the temple before we go on to the next place. Um, and just complete all um, areas, really. Now, there was an excavation point back here, I noticed last time. There it is. There's one there. Is there any more? I don't know if the areas... Um, respawn or anything is there any more places to go through here doesn't look like it goes on to anywhere else okay cool um he's feeling a bit flirty oh it's because he went through the romantic waterfall area i definitely like him to 
maybe uh, start a family or something at some point. Right, so we went through this part and then we went down here. Went through that bit, went through that bit. And so we were here. Okay, and we wanted to examine that. Okay, so he'll be down in a minute. He should just run down here in theory. Where is he? There he is. Okay. Oh, let's just clear our uh, thing off. There we go. So it's nice and we can see everything. It's it's good like this. <laughs> Um, he's only level one of the Salvadorian skill. It shouldn't take too long to actually get it up. So, um, Angelo figured out that some of these triggers won't work. Yeah, okay. Um, activate. So, it must be called the left warrior's weapon because the others ha two had a thumbs down. I mean, the tunnels are pretty straightforward. <gasps> Few Angelo has gained some hand in his skill. Ooh, this thing has to stop doing stuff like that. Oh my god. Where's my hand in his skill? He's only level one of it. Oh my god. Examine this and let's see what this says. This had the fruit selection we it, we have to use different fruits which we have because of those trees oh look we got a clump and we've got the archaeology table that we bought from the merchant okay come on dude what's the verdict so angelo figured out that some of these yeah okay so do we want to go energized or inspired? The panic on your face. I know, right? Uh, do we need to go? Oh, I don't know which one we need to do. Inspired. Oh. Inspired or energized? I reckon energized because of where we are. I'm going to go energized. Eat a Vimberry. Oh my god. Oh my god, come on, dude. I don't want to step on it. <laughs> I don't want to step on it. I got a 50 50 chance. It's glowing red. wrong activation and Joe Angelo definitely did not activate the correct trigger those temple defenses are terrifying Angelo nearly soiled oh my god so he instantly peed oh my god it made him pee himself because I got the wrong one oh my god right at least we had that so we can uh shower off oh my god oh we definitely need to buy more of them okay so the other option oh emma said energized good to know that you were gonna get us in trouble as well um inspired we want to go inspired then i knew i should have just eaten those ones in the first place it's always inspired in this game. Always. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Happy days. And there goes the fog. Oh, God. That's enough trap. This temple's going to kill me. Or actually give me a heart attack, one or the other. I've got hair stuck on my lip gloss. I can feel it. It's really annoying me. Oh, I can't believe that. Oh, it's all right. It wasn't the end of the world. It could have been a curse. I don't know how to cure the curses. So, 
Yeah, that could have been fun. Oh, we acquired the logic skill. Very nice. Come on. Yeah, you figured something. Oh. Your face makes all of this amazing. Thanks. I'm glad my face is entertaining. <laughs> um, tree glyphs or leaf glyphs? What do you guys think? Emma, Rachel, first one to, or anyone else, first one to uh, put something in the comments, I'll do it. Because I don't want a responsibility of doing this anymore. It's too scary. <laughs> it really is. Oh my God. I'm literally going to, my sim, look at this. My sim might like just die of fright at this point. Oh my god, I was doing the uh, Stone Age and uh, my, uh, for Through the Ages, a new challenge that I'm creating. And the episodes will be out really soon. But oh my god, Adam, Adam nearly went and um, uh, laughed himself to death. Oh my god. When Sims get very amused, oh my god, it is the scariest thing ever like ridiculous so oh which one should we go for because i don't want to choose oh really don't want to choose i'm gonna have to choose aren't i don't make me choose please let me examine it more is there anything else we can do in here oh we can uh excavate that do I want to open a treasure box? Last time I did that, and it was, it was, there was stubborn things. <laughs> I sound like a spoiled brat. <laughs> I really, really do. It's okay. It's okay. We can keep breathing. Um, that's not bad. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to do it. We're gonna go for tree. Oh, leaf. Mark says the leaf. Okay. Thank you, leaf. Uh, thank you, Mark. Leaf, leaf. Okay, assemble leaf glyphs. This is all Mark's fault. Hashtag blame Mark. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. <sighs> Def and now has a mouthful of bone dust. He doesn't seem to be upset about this bone dust. That is the happiest face I have ever seen. What's... Ah... Uh... Oh my god. Well, let's go for the tree glyphs. <laughs> it was a 50 50 chance. Here we go. What happened? He gained logic. So these things only seem to gain um, things. Okay. So he's examining the skeletons. Handiness skill went up. Oh, I can't believe that. I thought it was those that, um, I thought it was these things that caused, <laughs> good, <laughs> I can't believe that all of them are bad. Well, I just won't press any then, will I? I'm sure it was the those things that uh, does the um, oh what's it called the curse the curse curse okay what are we gonna find treasure um, and adventure gear 
what gear did we get? So we got some free, free, far, far a day fizz. Uh, this bubble drink removes the ill effects of one too many encounters with electricity. We got the Omiskin skull. We got another one of these, which means we can sell one of them. Okay. Right. Why do I feel like I get one choice? Well, clearly we have to open this one. What do you guys Go think? On. Go on. Let's open this. What's going to happen? What's the worst that can happen? Okay, he's happy. Temple exploration complete. Yay. So Angelo found the ultimate treasure of the temple. He should take a look around for other discoveries before leaving. Okay, so he found some Smolians as well. And he has gear in here. And we already had that one. Oh, we got a stripped quartz uh, gold parasia, which is 8,000 simoleons. Oh my God, that's incredible. Is it greedy if we open this one as well? I feel like probably. Okay, he's happy. Woohoo! And we have some fire foam. We have some unauthenticated Omiskin masks. Fab. Okay, so we did pretty well from that. And we have completed the temple. So let's get him to travel back. I'd like to know. So if we did nothing, um, how much have we earned from this one journey? Uh, obviously going through the jungle so we got all of that stuff as well 8,000 plus the 10,000 for the um, plate that we sold already so 18 and a half thousand smoleons from one trip one full trip that's not bad going that's really not bad going I'm really surprised at that because when I tried this obviously in um the making money scenario challenge with Harold Sims and Erin the Rescue Simmer, we had a really, really bad time. And I ended up just quitting trying that as a way of making money. So, yeah, the fact that we've just earned so much money, I'm really, like, surprised and happy. Right, so we'll get those out. We're going to sort out his needs. So we'll get him to sleep, pee, shower, eat, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Very exciting stuff when someone says blah, blah, blah. Well done for not dying in the temple. I know. I'm really surprised. I'm really happy. Um, yeah, it, it happened. It worked. It all worked out for the best. He's just going about his business. Why didn't you pee? I don't know why he didn't just pee. It was like, I don't want to do that. Okay. Have some origami. And then let's start uncovering some of these fat, pet, pet, these artifacts and stuff. See if we can get them to be worth a little bit more. I love the clutter in this kitchen. I feel like they could have probably put more in here, but some of it's really nice. Um, come on, hurry up. <laughs> I really want to get him to get on with this. <laughs> sort his needs out and just get, move on. <laughs> okay, awesome. Because we're now doing, um, streams that have an ending. I'm starting to plan out things that we're going to do in the future for different um, streams. Uh, so when we have finished this, what will we go on to next? 
and things like that and so one of the things is to complete university because I know that can be quite a tricky one to do I cannot believe it they gave me the promotion well done dude that's that's fantastic that is some of the story mode that they've recently added in coming into play which is quite nice okay so he has oh like a crystal skull here a smoky quartz skull that's now worth 246 so we'll put that in our inventory and then let's just check here so this is worth 24 smolians however if we go to uh we said that's worth 20 24 simoleons so let's see how much it is worth after because i didn't actually check the first price of the other one so you know it might have been a lot more or less <laughs> god damn it we keep getting attacked by things you got this dude i believe in you oh he's got another one of them wonder how much this will be worth keep going oh, it's worth 65 now I'm guessing he's authenticating it and so now it's worth 325 so that's literally gone from 24 simoleons to 325 so that's pretty damn good um what are you gonna go do let's get him to uh, go to the bar and he can have a little fun maybe um, go meet some uh, potential partners because that would be nice he's Indiana Jones hell yeah he is just what I was going for Indiana Jones <laughs> he is getting this done he is earning the Somalians or finding the Somalians more likely and he's doing a pretty damn good job while he does it I'm really proud of him okay I think after that long, long day, he needs to come to the bar and get a drink. Let's let's order his favourite drink. Let's find out what his favourite drink is as well. I think he is very much in need of a drink and a dance and maybe a little bit of romancing with someone. Okay. You look a little bit interesting. You look interesting. I don't like his moustache. Uh, so what's his favourite drink? It's juice on the rocks. Okay. You're a little bit... Oh! Why do people keep glowing? I don't understand why people are glowing. Like, they're just really random. Hello. I don't like the way you look. <laughs> I'm really mean. <laughs> just like, no, no, no. Does he like Latin pop music? Sure, you can like that. Um, Come on. Oh, purple hair. He looks interesting. Why? I don't understand <laughs> why people are doing that. Let's do a friendly introduction to this guy. You look interesting. I like your hair. Oh, he's got a moustache. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Hello. You look interesting. Let's go say hi. Ah, oh, friendly. Respectfully introduce yourself. Where's he gone? Where's she gone? I don't know where that person went. There she is. What's her name? I do not know. And she's a mixologist. So I don't know if that means we can't get with her. Why? Is people glowing? I don't understand. It's really confusing. Who was that? No. <laughs> oh my god I don't think there's anyone for him in this bar Oh, oh Chloe oh she's a stray oh the poor little doggy 
Come and say, get the doggy quick. Where are you? Dude. No, stop talking to people and go and get that dog. There's a stray dog. Get up. Oh my God, are you serious? Dude, move. I want that dog. Where'd the dog go? There she is. You better move your backside. Ah, oh, I'm getting really cross with you. Move. Ah, oh, the dog's going away. I'm getting really angry with him. The dog's going to go because he won't move his behind. Thank you. Now he's moving and the poor dog's probably gone. I want that dog. Ah, oh, do you know what, dude? Do you actually know what I just... Yeah. I'm really cross with him. I'm really, really cross with him. Ah, oh, What are those moves? Ah, oh, I can't believe we didn't get the dog. I feel like he should have a companion, a dog that can travel with him. But I don't know if we're going to have to go home for that sort of thing. Oh, here we go. Right, so if we do these interactions with this person, then we will be able to um, increase our skill level. Oh, he's gone to pee. Oh my god. This sim is really, really annoying me. I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm really getting cross with him. He is not doing anything he is supposed to do. And he's not doing anything I tell him to do. Like that stray dog, we could have gone and said hi and potentially had a friend. But no, he wouldn't go and say hi at all. <sighs> Can take a breath. I am not gonna get stressed. It's a game. Really? Why have I got so many of these things? Bots coming into my stream. It's really, really annoying. Ooh, dig sites. He's too uncomfortable. Of course, you're too uncomfortable because you're a pain in the backside. Ugh. Why are you not letting me do anything properly? Stupid thing. Ah. Thank you for that, Rachel. It wasn't letting me do it on my end for some reason, so. That's why I got moderators. <laughs> the bots, the bots are real. The problem is, is when you start getting too many bots come in, YouTube also won't promote your video either, which doesn't help matters, really doesn't. Bots really piss me off. I shouldn't swear, but they really piss me off. Right, let's get him to authenticate some more and let's see if we can get this simoleons going. Which one was he about to do? I have no idea. Authenticate this head. Oh, it's one of the heads. 165 and one is 65. They're both 65 Smolians. Ah, is he missing home? He is, he's homesick. He's been away for too long. Oh, maybe we should let him go home, but probably not because I want to stay here. <laughs> Bess can go and do one because I'm not giving her money. Bess, in case you didn't know, is from Eco Living and she's a scam artist. And we'll get loads of Smolians out of you. So this one's worth 62 Smolians. Okay. He needs social again? Seriously? Wow. ridiculous 62 smolians how much are you gonna be worth I am curious 224 very nice have we got any more 
else we do let's just keep going until we've done all of them so this little guy is worth 61 simoleons this can definitely bring in the simoleons if you stick at it but you do need to stick at it and not give up like i did last time <laughs> i am curious how many days it's gonna take us um this one's worth 35 wow that lost value damn oh it's counterfeit wow i didn't know you could get counterfeit but actually as you can authenticate it makes sense that that would be the counterpart which is counterfeit <laughs> Uh, we'll probably go out the following day to another temple location, I think, at this rate. And I am hoping to stream to quite late this time because Tom isn't in work until 5pm tomorrow. He is putting the babbies all to bed. So I'm hoping to just stay on here. It will mean in like half an hour we'll have a five minute break but i will put you on the paused screen 850 simoleons very nice right that's all of them authenticated let's sort out his knee excuse you let's sort out his needs and stuff we do need to head home at some point because we do we can't actually buy things on this lot it gets your skill level up though even if it's counterfeit yeah no that's very true it does uh he's gonna get something to eat what's he doing salad i hope it's a salad you're so mean holding a sim against the wheel lock. he's happy i mean look at him he's so focused um he's 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 a little lonely as well really dude you're just showing me up now right let's turn that off and get him to go to sleep <laughs> and in the morning we will go on another adventure i also want to go home so that we can get him a pet i think that would be really nice now one other thing guys and this is down to your decision i don't think we will do this in one generation so it means we'll need to have multiple generations should we either get someone sort of knocked up and have the child join his family when they're a bit older or do we oh it's love day or do we adopt a child because we could do either um let me know it, this is completely do, uh, down to a stream choice of adoption or um, get someone pregnant and then when the child is older then um, having them join. We are When we do head back however we will definitely get them to um, get him to get a dog. I do want him to get a dog. Let's go and talk to this person because he's really lonely, so he needs to get that up a little bit. Sing about love day. I mean, well, we can do some uh, some flutterberries. Why not? Something like that. Heartfelt compliment. Discuss local heritage. We'll slowly get our um our um oh what's it called our culture skill up salvadorian culture skill up oh he's about to give a should be really vain and give her a gift of himself oh no this is a gift of the person's uh a person that we we're trying to take uh, for the um advert thing photo i have no idea what i'm on about anymore um a fire up look wait i saw a local one chat about local sites chat about local sites ask about the jungle mm. done that one 
complain about Love Day. Nice. Dance with Camilla. Throw confetti. Okay. Right. His needs are up. Let's get him to see what we've got over here. I really need some of that um, adopt. Emma says adopt. Okay. So maybe we could go when he's nearly on like his death bed. When you created this sim, you said, and I quote, let's see how many sims we can impregnate. <laughs> oh dear, I, yeah, that sounds like me. I think you're right, Emma, adopt. Okay, so we'll go for adoption. I just want these rolls. They better not have a, like, wait, how long do they last for? Use it now or in a hundred years, it will taste the same. What the heck? I, that's just not right like what is that for liquid rush we'll leave that um can i buy the machete i don't know what this plant's for but you know we'll have it you're sold out dude i just bought everything um right i also wanted to do this because it's really annoying me let's work quit job <laughs> let's get rid of that that's, that's done yes please right perfect let's get him to get something to eat order food i wonder what he's gonna order probably something i cannot pronounce oh, oh a burger i can pronounce burger <laughs> oh dear hi dude how are you doing you fancy a chat you know Oh, Salvadorian introduction. So that's something new. That's um, one of the interactions with game because of our Salvadorian skill, which is currently level three. But we're not going to do a Salvadorian introduction, apparently. Right, here we go. I believe this is a kiss on the cheek. Yay, I was right. Lovely. Okay, let's get him to pee and then we're gonna go on an adventure. Adventure time. I really want a dog to show up again. <laughs> I really want a dog. Right, let's go pee and then adventure. We are gonna go down ooh, into another place. So, another location time. Yeah, I think it'd be really nice for him to have a dog to take on his travels. Maybe go for a typical, like, adventure dog, something like a Dalmatian or a German Shepherd or just something like that. I think that would be uh, typical. <laughs> but that is fine. Excuse me. <laughs> that was much louder than I was expecting. God damn it. Uh, I can't see anything on the floor to get. Okay, let's travel through. At least you don't have to do this thing over and over again. So we still, we have this, the one that we can clear. So let's go down this way this time. Let's see what is down here. And at least he can use the machete. Again, guys, once you've seen this, once you've seen it a thousand times, it's the same animation over and over again. <laughs> ah, here we go. Okay, what pop ups are we gonna get? Archaeologist in need. Okay, oh, fishing skill. Angelo is blazing a trail through the thick jungle when he comes across a distressed archaeologist who seems to have dropped her bag in some quicksand. So we can either keep walking. Oh, use flower stem to recover bag. We have that. I just bought two of them. I had no idea why I bought them, but apparently I bought them for this exact reason. <laughs> quicksand escape. 
Angelo has a flash of inspiration and pulls a large flower out of his bag. He snags the bag strap onto the stem of the flower and pulls with all his might. The bag and the flower go flying through the air. The flower lands in a patch of mud, but the bag lands next to Angelo, completely intact. The archaeologist is so grateful that she gives Angelo a cool artifact. <laughs> oh dear. We got an unauthenticated Omiskan statue. Okay, so we got through lovely, 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 lovely. What have we got here? So we've got one. Oh, we got a ruined plane. Very cool. We've got, it's you. You're the one. You're the one that turned me into a skeleton last time and made me cry. Um, we have another dirt pile. And then it looks like we're going up into a statue. Okay, so let's grab these dirt piles. Uh, anything we can't do there, we can grab that. And then I don't want to open the chest. Hey Angelo, I've been thinking about getting to know Filippi Grassi a little better. Do you think the two of us should hang out? I think you should go for it. Why not? I have no idea who this guy is, by the way. He's he's just one of his neighbours. Um, I hope he's not married and I'm telling him to hang out with another person. You know, I could be a bit awkward when I get home. <laughs> how long have we got left of our travels uh, home <laughs> it doesn't say okay oops that's my notebook oh oh good idea I suggest you save your game <laughs> if you're gonna open it yes Okay, you ready? We've saved. We're gonna go do it. What could possibly go wrong? Oh, <laughs> I don't wanna do this. Oh my God, okay, come on. It's gonna be fine. Yes! <laughs> Nothing happened. Felipe Salsa. Hey, I heard you became friends with Cam Camilla. Uh, she's pretty cool. Awesome. Okay, um, so we didn't die, which makes me very happy. We got some treasures. We got some stuff. And we're not dead. So, yay. Okay, we have, oh, another dirt pile. Wait, can we not? Oh, we can't go up there. So is this just a dead end? This is just a dead end. This just has some random stuff. That's not the chest that turned me into a skeleton. I've lost the chest that turned me into a skeleton. Because the chest that turned me into a skeleton uh, was linked to a um, other place. Magic. Oh my God. Right, you ready? We're gonna go back through and go to the next location then. So this is going, let's grab more of these fruits because why not? I'm gonna cross here. Oh, that pile is back. Wait, does that mean there's not another pile down here? He likes gardening. No, we don't have piles down here. Okay, just double checking everywhere. I don't wanna go missing anything major to be honest. We got piles up here. We don't. Let's travel through. Oh, he's all romantic again. This is going pretty straightforward. Nothing major has happened. Oh no. <laughs> I say that and we get attacked by a swarm of bees. Okay, so we have one, two, or can we go? Is four an option? Four is not an option. You always look so nervous. That's because I'm always nervous. Okay, uh, stream's choice, door one or two. We have already done three and we cannot go through four yet. 
Oh, I think we're going to be nearly done. We're going to be done with this place in no time. I wanted to complete this place um, like with generations, but actually we might complete this entire, like complete all of the jungle places with just him fairly quickly which is a little bit sad i would have liked to have made like a lot more money oh look at that ass of view that is a stunning view i love this place it makes me so happy what's he doing oh he's just like sun gazing <laughs> he's sun gazing right now I'm wondering what the ch chances are that if I message my other half and go, can you make me a tea if he'll do it? <laughs> it's a love day. He's going to be, he's going to have such a bad day. I chose last time at your go, Emma. Okay. I mean, he's just outside here. He's like, you know, you guys, you, you just go in your own time. <clears throat> oh, look, he's got an, a pile to excavate. <clears throat> and a bush to harvest yeah he's got stuff and things he can do like eat as well Emma is gone <laughs> oh dear let's eat some bananas I mean he's uh um, no, thank you. Okay, we are going to go through door number one. Yeah, we're going through door number one with a machete. What's that? Preparation perfection. All right. Oh, mysterious egg, rocket science. Oh dear. Okay, so Angelo is forging through the jungle when he almost trips over a large, strange looking egg just lying on the jungle floor. Who knows what creature is inside? What should Angelo do? Leave the egg alone? Uh, examine old egg which we need a high rocket skill so we, we're just gonna go for it angelo isn't sure what to make of the egg and gives it a good shake a soft roar comes through the shrubs nearby seems like the egg's parent is a bit upset by angelo's action um a giant creature lunges its head forward wait it lunges its head out spews fire at Angelo he runs to safety but gets a little singed in the process probably shouldn't have shaken an egg oh we're going to the baths the Omskin royal baths very nice <laughs> going to the royal baths not just the baths the royal baths okay oh wow look at this place you should probably buy a tent Let's get him to have a little swim around. Go skinny dipping with... There's someone here. Oh my god, there is someone here. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I'm just like getting naked in front of you. Didn't know there was someone else here. <laughs> oh dear. Hey, how you doing? We're going to do a Salvadorian introduction in the nude. Sing about love day. How you doing? You good? My sim's just here, just butt naked. My sim's actually just butt naked here. He doesn't care. I mean, I, this is just brilliant. Um, let's let's give him an avocado. Um, discuss local heritage. Ask if single. I mean, ah, oh, look at the treetops. It's so pretty. Oh, he's holding a glass. <laughs> That's from one of my um, poses that's in here. Oh dear. I don't think he's impressed with our nudity. 
what I miss I was munching. You left me hanging, Emma. Like, I, I asked a question and you just left me hanging. I was waiting, expecting you, and you just weren't there. You cut me deep. Now, we have just um, been chatting with a guy naked. As you do, you know. <laughs> I can't believe this guy is just like okay with us being butt naked in front of him. He just, yeah. He, he, my sim's not even like embarrassed. Although he, he didn't appreciate our gift very much. <laughs> Let's ask him to hang out. I wonder if we can woohoo in the water with him. Yeah, he really needs to be. You alright, dude? Where's the toy? No. Okay, let's take him back. We will head back um, once we've sorted out our needs and stuff, and we'll get back to the same point again. <laughs> oh, dear. I can't believe I just have my sim there butt naked in front of another sim. Just not caring. He's just there. Oh dear. I mean, I reckon, especially as we've already discussed in chat, that we're going to have him be, um, have him adopt a child anyway. I reckon we should invite this guy out on a little trip to the next temple. Oh my god. I'm delighted you recommended I spend time with Felipe. Pay. I was amused the entire time. That's fantastic. I think I might have just like I'm I'm making this guy's relationship happen for him. Oh, we are gonna jump out of bed with a zing. Yes, please. Um and yeah, when we travel, I think we should take um, that guy with us. Oh, we're still missing home. He's homesick. Oh, I feel well guilty, but he's just so sad. Um, let's travel then. And we will take Sergio with us. I don't know if he's single. Uh, I mean, we could break up his romance. Your sims always end up naked, lol. They do not. <gasps> the indignity of such a uh, response, of uh, an accusation. Hello, Erin the Rescue Simmer. Wow, thank you for joining us. We are here doing our jungle adventure um, thing again i i want to know if he's single because if he's not single then we have found his love um why <laughs> I don't, hostage situation Hot, right so i'm being accused of always having naked sims and now a hostage situation i mean damn what do you guys think of me my friends cut me deep Oh, really? Another one? Bots! Oh my god! The bots are out to get me! I might have to get you guys to ban the bots to stop them from coming into chats in the future. Because what happens is when you end up with too many bots, and the bots do make their rounds, they'll um, target channels um, at random times. Um, but yeah, they, they, um, so who is Sergio? Sergio is a local and, um, we already discussed what, how we were going to proceed forwards with babies and things. Cause we're not going to be able to make a million simoleons from, just one generation so we agreed that we were going to um we agreed that we were going to adopt a child and so as we don't need to get anyone pregnant it means that he doesn't have to be straight i think we should 
um, have him have a male partner. I think that would be beautiful. Um, so Sergio is going to be his love and his communication partner because his social keeps going down and it's driving me freaking insane. Okay, let's... Oh, we're level four. Very nice. We need to get to level five of the... Five, five of the Salvadorian uh, thing and assemble a mystical relic and defend against two natural dangers. What? I don't like that. Does this lead to a door down here? Oh no, this just leads to another place. So Sergio is going to be his boyfriend and then potentially husband. Right, so we discovered that one, that door down here leads to a dead end. We need to make sure that we are harvesting and looking for all these ex excavated points as we go along. Okay, come on, dude. We've got this. Yeah. I'm always in such a rush. I press the fast forward button way too much, like way too much. Oh my God. I swear, as soon as my views start coming in, my legs go numb and my butt goes numb. Uh, Sergio is very important then. What level is he at for adventuring? Uh, Sergio, Sergio, I have no idea. And is there a level four adventuring? Oh, oh, did you see that? He just got, oh, he did the thing. Awesome. Although he did that against one and got it for two, but I don't know where Sergio went. That's not ready to be harvested yet. So we'd gone through one. So we were going to the Royal Baths. Um, yeah, so I think so far it's going really well. Hit and miss. <laughs> Very much hit and miss, but so far so good. I don't know where our boyfriend to be went. You were with us. <gasps> Invite to join vacation. Yeah, so... You go through and you've got the archaeology skill. The Salvadorian culture skill is, there's five levels to this. If you want to know about any skill in a sim or any uh, anything sim related, check out the website gamingwithshire.com where I have tutorials on everything. So there's five levels in the Salvadorian skill, uh, culture skill, and that's talking to locals and uh, completing the jungle explorer aspiration um, and then of course you've got the archaeology uh, aspiration uh, skill sorry and we have the archaeology table back at our base our, our travel lot um, and you can put all these items on there to excavate Natural dangers is like your spiders. Yeah, so we did that once. I don't recall him doing it a second time, but he's got that, so that's fine. Oh, well, this is such a beautiful world. I don't play here enough. I know, right? I mean, you have the baths. We've just reached the baths here. Oh, look at that. That's a bird. It's a bird in the middle of the pool. I had no idea. And yeah... I mean, even if you look around, you can see there's one of the temples there. If you travel around, you can see all the different temples that you can travel to and visit. Um, I haven't gone to all of them. But yeah. Okay. So is there anything here that we can... Oh, hello. Oh. This path is sealed shut and cannot be opened on this trip. Perhaps next vacation it will open. Oh, okay. Um, so there's a couple of doors like that. So can we not travel any? So there's nowhere else here we can actually travel. Oh, there's a dirt pile there we can excavate. Hey, I heard you became friends with Sergio. He's pretty cool. Okay, let's get him to travel back. 
and go through door number two. We went through three, we've been through one, so now it's two. And then door number four was sealed shut in the same way. So I'm guessing we'll go, have to go home and come back again to get through there. I like that you have to come multiple times. Oh, look at that, there's a power up here. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Sims team, give me birds. I want to have a pet parrot. Okay, so here is door number three. Let's go through. And we'll have another pop-up. Uh, pop-up. That's a fun sound. Okay, abandoned pack. <laughs> Angelo stumbles upon what appears to be an abandoned campsite. Clearly, a previous adventurer has been through here as there's the remainders of a small fire and an old tattered knapsack. There might still be something valuable inside or something dangerous. So if we have level, lo, high logic skill, we'll get better results. Oh, we have two machetes, so we are going to do that. Angelo decides to put some distance between himself and the bag and slashes the bag open using the machete. A poisonous scorpion crawls out of the bag and scampers away into the jungle. Angelo digs through the remains of the pack and finds some useful gear. What did we find then? Oh, he's feeling all romantic again. Uh, we just found a pack. Oh, and we found some shower bottles. Yes, please. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, there. It's you, isn't it? I'm suspicious. I'm sure it's you. Is it? I think it is. What do you think? <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> I'm not going to get nervous. Beautiful. See? Relaxed as a cucumber. <laughs> okay, what have we got around here? We got some crocs that aren't real. Oh, we got a few dig sites. We got three, very nice. Give me what you've got. Okay, so we've got that, we've got that. So this just looks like a beautiful little spot. Shifty eyes, yeah, I know, right? I've still, I've lost that one I came across randomly. So there is a fishing spot up here. Let's see if we can get Sergio to come up here and um, spend a little bit of time with us. Oh, can't I? I can chat to him. Why can't I invite him up here? God damn it. Um, Should we see? We can do a little bit of fishing, see if he can uh, find and fish together. Where is he? Okay, this will force him to come up here. Croc just swimming away in there. As you do. There he is. Oh, he's in his swimming pants. He's in his panties. Um, lots. Uh, oh, where was that? Compliment. Compliment. Mighty fine garb. Let's do it. Turn the old sea tail. Stop fishing. Oh my god. Can I get him to go here with us? It's really annoying. Wait, there, is there a dig site? Survey dig site? Angelo can take Sergio out to the bar later. I think he might have to because he's not interested in talking to me. He's just there fishing away. Okay, we go. 
We shall go then. Goodbye, Sergio. Oh, for God's sakes. Go home. Here we go. Well, I think we've made quite a lot of simoleons, to be honest. Um... <clears throat> Okay, yeah, so I think we've made quite a lot of simoleons on this trip so far. I do think I'm going to end the trip, though. Um, it's eight. Before we end the trip, let's, as as um, Aaron said, take Sergio to the bar. So let's see if we can invite him out on a date or something, I'm wondering. Where is he? I've lost him. There he is. Oh, that's really annoying. I want to end take him out for a day. I guess we need to have some sort of um friendship. Yeah. Maybe, maybe we have to have some sort of uh, relationship, uh, romantic relationship before we can do dates. I'd like to just like become friends and then, yeah, oh well, that's fine. They can have a loving and romantic relationship. Maybe we can get Sergio to move in with him or they could just be long distance lovers potentially with obviously us taking many many trips i really want to try and get some romantic relationship going let's see what happens come on you know you want to Confess some attraction. I can't make it any clearer for you, Sergio. We like you. We like you a lot. Let's be more than friends. Yeah? Unfurl sails. <laughs> Ignog. Uh, local salutation. Right, so we've got a romantic... Uh, Asked to rock boat. Not sure what this is. <laughs> oh, we have a good relationship. That's uh, re reputation. Sorry, that's nice. I think they look. They look so good together. Yeah, you enjoying it? You enjoying a little bit of flirting, Sergio? Uh, ask if single. I don't think he's actually answered this question. Um, he's unflirty. It's always my luck. This always happens. I get an unflirty sim. I hate the unflirty trait. I really hate it. Right, let's end our vacation. We we came out, we took him out, and um, then he annoyed me. Uh, vacation day is left too. Oh, no, I don't want to extend it. They do look to get good together, don't they? Um, end vacation. Yes, we're going to go home so that we can come back. We're going to get a dog while we're um, home as well, Aaron. I'm sure you'll be, you will like that. <clears throat> yeah, we'll go ahead and get a dog as well so that he's got a compa companion as well while he's out and about that can travel around with us I also want to go ahead and buy a tent and probably sell the house or at least downsize quite a lot because I just don't think that he needs all of this room um, so let's get him to grab some dinner first some cereal, he's getting cereal Fair enough. He's He's been out exploring. He comes home and he's just like, I'll have cereal. Screw it. It's all I want. I want some cereal. And he had a craving, clearly. And I wanted to put that in our inventory because we forgot about it last time. 
Like, that would have been so good to set up. Oh, that's tough. What if you went into full edit mode and fixed the unflirty tray? I could do that. I'm going to try and do it, though. Um, I'm going to try and make it so that he uh, still, they still get together. Just maybe they don't have such a romantic relationship. They, they're still romantic, but like not so romantic. Hire a service. That's what I'm looking for. And then adopt a dog. I do like the dog. Can the dog come advent? Yes, definitely. We want a dog that will go adventuring. I ideally like to get a dog that already is an adventurer. I want uh, none of these are really. They're not really taking my fancy. In all honesty. Hmm. Maybe we'll travel to Bridlington Bay. See what dogs are hanging around over there. I don't think any of this that one might be all right it's a dash hat no it's not gonna get big enough I want a quite a big dog like a um can't think of the words oh no oh no I'm yawning that's no no that's really bad uh like a German shepherd or Dalmatian or Something like that. Something that's, an, uh, you know, an active and big dog that could take care of itself as well. Uh, right, so let's go to Bridlington Bay and see if we can go and find a dog. So that's the cat hangout. Where's the dog hangout? That's a cat hangout. Is this not an anything hangout? I don't know. Maybe we can turn it into a dog hangout. I like the idea of going to Bridlington Bay. Um, yeah, I, th I think it's going to be the best bet. In Bridlington Bay, we're going to have um, strays that are around as well, which will be ideal. I'm going to turn the lounge into a dog hangout because the bar's a cat hangout, so I feel like the dog should have a hangout as well. Um and we can do that just by clicking on this button here and going up here and adding dog hangout and breeding ground why not the beach is where the dogs hang out oh is it okay well we we have a dog hangout as well what is this place you see, this looks like it should be a dog hangout. Okay, let's head down to the beach then. Apparently that is the actual um, dog hangout. Come on. Oh, baby, you can do this. I need to save this. I really need to save this. Yeah, that will be the next option. So where's the beach? Oh, I have just seen there's a park up there. Dog friendly. Right. We're saving this now because... Wait, did I just save it? I don't know. I might have just saved it. I might be going a little bit stir crazy. Um... Well, that's dog friendly. There's nowhere that says specifically dog hangout. Obviously, the dog park. You have to go to one of the houses. Oh, okay. Right, well, we've made this place a dog hangout, so dogs will, in theory, be along shortly. Um, hopefully come on dogs where are you where the dogs are where the dogs are I'm getting nervous oh yes I am oh my god what's going on 
Oh dear. The Bellington Boathouse, I think. Okay, we might have to go over there. I really don't want to spend too long just waiting. Okay, let's travel over to the Bell House then. Because Erin is the Sims Cats and Dogs queen. So, the boathouse. There's the boathouse. Let's see. Let's see if there's a bunch of dogs down here. So, if any of you guys don't know, Erin the Rescue Simmer has an incredible series pet rescue shelter she works with real shelters as well with real dogs that are out for adoption and she rescues sim doggies and kitties in this game as well she, her channel is incredible and so unique as well there's very few channels that are truly unique but erin's definitely is there takes some time uh, sometimes it takes a while for them to spawn okay um can we like just go nap then while we wait for some to spawn in oh 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 that's a cat at least i know uh it's saved and you've always been crazy well that's very true Oh, shadows are stray, but you're a cat, sweetheart. I don't need a cat. I want a dog. Oh, the shadow suddenly isn't a stray anymore. They're very good. Hey, right, dogs, where are you? That's a cat. Okay. Well, we'll let him eat once he's eaten. If we haven't seen any doggos running around here, then we will go ahead and travel home, see if the dogs have refreshed, because they do refresh. What are you? You don't look like a travel dog anyway. It's you, you little bugger. Chloe! Oh my god, it's like fate. It's like fate. At the beginning of the stream, well, middle of the stream, like an hour ago, I saw Chloe in Jungle Adventures. We were in the bar, but he wouldn't run over to her at all. And I was shouting at him, go, go, and he wouldn't go. And I kept trying to get him to go different places. and He just wouldn't do it. And here she is. It's like fate. The same little dog. I wanted a big dog, but the same little dog is here. It is literally like fate. She's a hunter as well. Oh my god. Oh my god. Chloe's ours. Guys, we are adopting Chloe. Oh my god. I can't believe she tra it's what she wanted us. She traveled all this way to get to us. Oi, do something stupid, Sim. <laughs> oh my god. I might get a little bit aggressive with my Sim. <laughs> oh my god, I just want her so badly now. Um, she is ours. If it suddenly goes off, I'm going to cheat to have her, just so you guys know. Because occasionally it will just suddenly say that, um, uh, that they're not they that they, they don't need adopting anymore like the stray disappears no 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 no! don't you dare don't you dare you little bugger where are you going pick her up oh don't you go don't do that option then run after her dude i think she's tired oh the poor little princess oh hunters are great you can pick on a dirt patch, click on a dirt patch and tell the dog to dig it up. Oh my god, I didn't know that. Oh, we need to adopt her. She's still astray, she just wants to go to sleep. Oh, bless her. Offer some friendship, come on. Chloe, you need to want us to adopt you. Let me do this properly. 
and then we'll have a little front i don't care what you're doing what are you doing don't you dare run away from the rain you little oh chicken it's a bit of rain adopt there's the option don't you dare run away don't you run away come on no adopt her yes <laughs> Oh, I don't know what his surname is. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, what's going on? B? I meant it's meant to be. Oh, it's meant to be. <laughs> oh. Try to be friends with her. Oh my god. I can't believe we got her, guys. Oh, we've got her. Oh, look at. Look at that. Oh my god, oh my god. She looks so happy. Oh, look at the way she's looking at him. Oh. Yes. Oh my god, she looks so happy. Okay, let's get these guys home. Oh, it's thundering. Right, we're gonna get home. We can go on another adventure soon. Oh, I can't believe that we finally have a little doggy. And it was Chloe. I can't believe we found her. I got so stressed out earlier. So stressed out earlier. That it wasn't working. And oh, she's so happy. Oh my God. <laughs> she's like the happiest dog in the world oh she reminds me a little bit of moshi okay let's give her a bath because she's our baby and i think she's gonna need a checkup and after she's had a checkup we will uh go on an adventure because you should always get your pets checked up before you go on an adventure but especially as we're practically going to go and live over there pet obsession why put that in your damn inventory i keep t i've put that in there a couple of times uh we'll just leave the house as it is let's oh uh okay let's travel with chloe She's a Pomeranian, I think. Your guess is better than mine, Erin. Um, I can probably find out. But let's let's take her to the vet clinic and get her all checked up. Because this is what we do. We pretend our Sims worlds are real. <laughs> oh. oh, my legs are going numb. Truly, truly numb. Oh, why have I got a photo? Let me see, let me see. Oh, <laughs> um, let's see. So if we go sign Chloe in for a checkup. I love that you can just do a, sing, a simple. Oh, he's asked us for a date, but our doggy comes in first now, Sergio. I am sorry, but we need to make sure she is good. We want to purchase some pet items as well. I know we're doing the making money challenge, but... Yes. <laughs> no, we don't need that. Um, want to make sure that she... There. We want that. We we want a few of these for our trip to uh, make sure that she's good. Is there anything that like helps them with stinkiness? I don't think so. Oh, look, Chloe's up here getting her checkup. Uh, he's caught Sergio's eye. Yeah, he finally has. Right, so let's get her a preventative shot. 200 simoleons. 
This shot will prevent your sim from your pet from getting sick in the near future. Better safe than sorry. Yes, it is. We're making sure Chloe is good and safe. And we can travel for one of our adventures. Oh, pet Simstagram. Dislikes photography. No, we don't want him to dislike it. Oh, look at that. If you got the gold bar, it makes them poop gold. Well, I mean, we shouldn't do that. We shouldn't do that just because we are doing the uh, making money jungle adventure, not uh, pets. So we won't do that. We, we won't do that. We, uh, yeah. You like to live your dream, dreams through your sims. Hell yeah, I do. Although actually, if that were true, my dream were, is to, you know, make money from this. So I would probably be a streamer. But, um, you know, you can do all the recording and stuff on there, which I would like to do the making money challenge with using the streaming station and stuff like that. I think that would be really cool. Um, but right now, oh, um, yeah, I hate that in The Sims uh, Festival. I don't care about the festival. Right, let's take a bath and eat something and go on holiday. Finally. <laughs> it's taking a while. I do apologize, guys. We're getting there, slowly but surely. I think I'm definitely making the most out of my packs in this scenario because like, we. oh my God, he was nude for so long again then. <laughs> um, oh, food for the dog. <laughs> That's terrible. I forgot about the dog. <laughs> Chloe needs food and a bed. Okay, let's get her a bowl. Let's uh, get her a bed. And we can put these in our inventory so they can go with us. I'm not sure if the toy box can go with us. But the ball and things definitely can. Okay. Mostly getting naked, woohooing, and accidental death. Yeah, that pretty much, yeah, we can't take that with us. That pretty much does sum it up. Let's, um, pet care. Ask to go potty. Tell her to go. I don't know if he did. Did she go to the toilet? I'm not sure. Is he really doing press-ups over the dog's butt? Wonderful. Um, let's get him to ask to go potty as well. And we're going to put that in our inventory and the ball in our inventory and hopefully the pet bed. Yeah, there we go. Right, let's go on holiday. That's notes. Holiday. Take a vacation. Chloe's going with us. We'll take Sergio with us. And try and get that romance going a wee bit more. Um, oh, wait, no. We don't want to take Sergio with us. He lives over there anyway. So that doesn't matter. Take vacation. We're taking Chloe. And we'll just invite Sergio out when we want to, rather than paying for him to be on holiday with us. Uh, Salvador. I also want to do the million with Batu as well, which is going to be interesting. Um, we'll obviously be staying. Should we stay in the cheapest, or maybe we could go to one that's a little bit more? No, we won't. We'll go. We'll go to the cheapest for the next seven days. Okay, fabulous. And see if we can uh, do this. Maybe. Right, let's get our items out. We're going to need to feed Chloe as well. Um, right, we're 
right, we've got her pet bowl. We've got her pet bed. Oh. All right, fine. Go in the middle of the room, Chloe. Why not? Can you go that? No. Okay, we're in the middle of the room for Chloe. And where's the archaeology table? Because we really need to get her, him to um, finish doing those. Okay, that's what we need. Let's fill the bowl and then dig and dig. He's lacking fun. Let's see if we can throw. Oh, I saw it there. Play fetch. You can dig up those and play fetch. Which is going to get up his. Oh, I love that. Look. Too cute. <laughs> She's like, no. Okay. Stress from unsuccessful training. Yeah, that was pretty successful. She went and got it like three times. Miserable git. Right, it's 3 a.m. I'm just going to get him to sleep till morning and then we will head out. Where's that ball gone? Oh, there it is. Cool. Uh, five. What is she doing? Okay. Um, I want to put that in our inventory. Okay. Are you ready? We are going for another adventure. Oh, she's just gone to sleep. Well, she'll be fine. Let's change into our outfit. Uh, our, uh, what's it called, adventuring outfit, and we'll travel. Well, we could leave Chloe here as she's having a snooze anyway. And we can always call her a little later, maybe. That's fine. Oh, I'm going to need to stretch my legs in a minute. Two hours? We've been streaming for two hours. Definitely need to uh, get up and move my legs in a minute. So maybe go make a cup of tea. Let's uh, excavate that. Hopefully those other locations that were close to us last time will be open now. And definitely getting Chloe to be able to do some of these dig sites, these excavated sites would be good if that's what she can do. Maybe it's a... Erin, is it only the dig sites that she can do that with, or is it excavated sites as well? Erin is the... Oh my god, there's another location here. Wait, where are we? Oh, it's closed up because uh, last time we were here. Uh, okay, does that mean we have to go through the pop-ups again? Yes. So as Angelo emerges into a clearing with a watering hole, he comes across a small family of capybaras. I said that wrong. Out for an afternoon drink. They look adorable, though the smallest one looks a bit scorched and upset. Should and Angelo attempt to see what's wrong? Right, we'll do the. We, we will do the um that. Oh, we've got the Faraday what fizz. Let's do that. Angelo cautiously approaches the small and rinses it off. The carabara looks a lot happier and bounds off into the water. As the creature runs away, Angelo notices something shiny in the water and fishes out the prize. So we got that and that. It looks like we got two things. Nice. Uh, that's not ready. Have we got any sites to dig up? Oh, we still can't go there. Oh, that's annoying because it's the same thing that it said last time. So we can dig that site. Nothing up there. Let's go through there. Okay. Ah! Ow! 
There we go. Oh, my legs. Um, I've only ever tried dog sites, but we could try. Fair enough. Well, we'll give it a go when we get a little bit further on into this place. We've got some food that we can eat, don't we? Where are those? There they are. Eat that. When you get to the other side. Here we go. We're running through this because we've been here for like... We've been here a couple of times. Oh, this is the abandoned pack one. Let's, oh, last time we used the machete, but we don't have one now. So we're gonna have to use a, uh... oh no, Angelo takes a quick look inside and decides it's pretty safe. As he opens the pack, a poisonous scorpion crawls out and stings him in the arm. Oh no. Oh no. That's not good. Okay. So we have been through all of these. Oh. That one was closed off to us last time. Yeah, because we've been through one, two, and three. So last time, this one was closed off to us. So that's good to see. God damn it. He is getting stung and bit. It's probably better that Chloe isn't here with us. Damn. Come on, dude. You got this. I'm going to kill my sim at this rate, aren't I? So I'm going to, at the end of this trip for him, we'll see how much he's actually made. What do you do if he's been poisoned? I have no idea. Oh, look at that. Oh, so as Angelio, uh, Angelo rounds the corner, there's a stillness in the air. He looks up and notices a bed of sloths. Are watching him. Angelia is distracted for a moment and walks in a slow hunch hanging branch, releasing a small band of fury flies, which fly at the sloths and begin to bother them, scorching their barren spots. So he can distract flies with a dance, and with a higher Salvadorian skill, this has better results, and we have quite a high one. So Angelo starts making noise as he embarks on a local dance, hoping to distract the flies from the sloths. The moves at work as the flies are confused by the whirling figure below and decide to fly off. A moment later, a crystal drops from the trees and as Angelo looks up and locks eyes with one especially friendly sloth, it winks back at him. Ah. That is so nice. Oh, look. He's got a sloth wink. Oh, my God. Ah, oh, my legs. <laughs> we might have to have a little pause in a minute, guys, so I can stretch my legs and pee and stuff. So we've got discovered from reaching a high hidden jungle area. What else do we have to do for this? So we need to do the last level of the Salvadorian culture and we have to assemble a mystical relic. Okay, how does that work again? So click on either a mystical relic top or bottom in the Sims inventory and select fuse with. Yay, so nice. It is, that is so cute. So we have the bottom, we can't fuse it. Maybe, is that what it means? Um, let's pause so you can stretch your legs I need to save it that's for sure yeah okay so we're gonna have a very quick break um uh, we'll put the intermission screen up I'm gonna pee I'm gonna grab a cup of tea um let's just yeah we will be back in a moment and we can look at a cute little puppy we'll be back 
goes my bedtime alarm. Bedtime is for the week. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
Okay then, I am back. Thank you guys for understanding that I have bodily functions. Oh, my leg really did go numb during that. Um, I was in the kitchen doing some weird, some weird moves. Like, <laughs> doing some weird stretches and jumps around. Okay then, um... We have called Chloe on over as well. He is viewing the, he is viewing it in wonderment. Oh, look at him, bless. You're looking a bit rough, dude. I mean, this adventure is not really uh, working for him. There is my Watsy. TMP is complete, yes. Completey. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, right, so we went through that. Oh. Is it you? <laughs> Were you the one that's going to turn me into a skeleton? It might be. It might just be, where are you going? Oh, it, is, it is this one. This is the one that turned me into a skeleton last time. Nope, nothing. Okay. I don't know what's happening. I'm sure it was that one because of the way it's opened up. Um, wait, this is a dead end as well. They're all dead ends. Where's the rest of these? tunnels and things all the temples are there no more temples i'm very confused i i'm not sure we're gonna make one million smolians with him in all honesty i just i just can't see it happening we will see though. See what happens. When we have finished this, we will. So he's gone through there. Oh, we have a couple of dig sites. Fabulous. Every little helps. Oh, Chloe's off for a run somewhere. We will clear this path with our hands because we're hard. <laughs> Here we go. I mean, maybe he can get halfway to the million or a quarter of the way to the million and uh, pass it on to another generation. All right, let's travel and get some more supplies. We are out of supplies, so let's go collect some more water and things like that. Um, and he can pee. Because he's not doing well. He's really not doing well. I want to see if the temple's reset as well. But there's only so many times we're going to be able to go through the same temple before it's boring. So... <laughs> Bless. He is looking rough as hell. Alright, let's get him to pee first before we do anything. Wait for these to fill up. It would be it it would be so cool if to have generations of explorers. It really would be cool to have generations of explorers. I'm just worried that it would also become boring. <laughs> Let's get him to come and do some practice on the guitar. Maybe so he can woo Sergio. I love that he's facing the wrong way. Oh, we just got two Somalians. Where's Sergio gone? I lost him. It's bar night, wanna hang out? No, I don't. Right, let's see what we got up here. We don't have any water. We'll grab that, grab that. Liquid Rush. Grab another one of those. At least he matches his t-shirt. <laughs> yeah, no, that's very true. 
Oh, we need some water and things out here and machetes. There has to be a better way of this. I don't know where um where he went. Where's Sergio? Oh, he went. Yes, the locals are taking pity. Apparently so. Oh, he got himself something to eat. Sergio disappeared off. He wasn't interested, which is a shame. I really needed someone to have, like, a machete and things. Uh, let's brush... Oh, why are you sad, little miss? Give Chloe some food. Uh, pet. I don't think she's happy being here. Right. Let's go home. Hopefully in the morning when we come back, we'll have some more machetes out and... We will have some, um, what are they called? Um, the, the water bottles for showers. They're the two that we desperately need and they don't have any out. I'm not sure where to get them from if not from there. <sighs> oh dear. So how is your day going, Erin? Because it's quite early on in the day for you, isn't it, still? Oh, let's hug her and get some food out for her because her food bowl is in our inventory, isn't it? There it is. So let's call Chloe to eat and we'll sit, uh, go to bed. Let's, in the morning, get him to... Um, Oh, he was able to overcome the sickness. That's good. We will get him to start doing some of this stuff, I think, once his needs are all set. Our bills are going to turn off. That's fine. They can all be turned off until we are ready to go home. Oh, that's dirty. Eat the oatmeal. It's 4 p.m. here. I've been sick today waiting on COVID results. Oh, bless you. Oh, well, you looked after your, one of your boys and, yeah, they had it. Oh, I really do hope that you are okay. All right, let's go through everything we currently have. Just go through everything that he has. See how much we have in the way of simoleons once we can sell it all. Um, I need to work out how to do this. So if anyone wants to look out how to assemble a mystical relic, that would be fantastic because I have not actually done it. <laughs> These items also look really cool. It would be great if we could like collect one of everything and store it. After carefully analyzing, after careful analysis, Angela has determined this artifact is genuine. So it's now worth 238 so I don't know what that does um, on the upside my son is pretty much over it and this is helping oh bless well that's so good that he is must be so scary oh he needs to pee Love the idea collect to collect. Yeah, I think it would be nice. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do that. Okay, let's grab the next artifact. Oh my god. 
He's running all over the place, especially in a legacy challenge. That seems ideal. Yeah, that it would be quite fun. We'll just have to see what actually happens because I'm quite good at having all of these wonderful ideas. What did you do? I'm not sure what he just did. He got a little bit confused then. <laughs> But yeah, let's see how much he earns from this lot. Because we still need to go back home to come back again to see if we can uh, unlock this last door. Because I'm pretty sure we've done everything so far. Oh no, what's wrong with Chloe? Oh. Stop doing that. You need to come and feed Cleo. Uh, Chloe. I keep going to say Cleo. Authenticate. I wonder if the next generation could become a teacher and visit in the weekends and holidays like Angelo inspires them to become a professor or something. Oh, I love that. That's beautiful. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's so cool. Put that in your inventory and let's get another one. Yeah, so like he's a full on uh, archaeologist and uh, adventurer, Indiana Jones. While, and then, yeah, when he. Oh, Sergio. Oh, no. <laughs> we wanted to be romantic with Sergio. Ah, oh, he wants to know if he should... A quick question, Maria Romeo and I were planning to spend some time together. Oh, go for it. Oh, we'll, we'll set our eyes on someone else. That bunny looks so cute. Cool. I know, right? That was crazy cool. I'm really curious as to how much. I mean, this one's worth currently 69 simoleons. And he's just authenticating it now. So it'd be interesting to see how much it is worth after. 108 UT. <laughs> oh, we've got to be kind though, Aaron. <laughs> Give everyone a chance at love, even if it isn't with us. You, you can clean up if you want. Oh, for God's sakes. Eat what I told you. God damn you. He's ours. No. We can share. And he was unflirty anyway, so it was annoying. We can find some other guy that's, like, more into us. And who is flirty. Because I am a romantic at heart. Say no, tell Sergio he's only for you. Hostage situation. No, oh my god. That got me then. I didn't like that. Yeah, kill it. You guys. You guys are awful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm here trying to have some wholesome gameplay like hostage situation he's ass <laughs> oh. and I'm the bad one oh yeah I definitely do love spiders Emma they make me so happy they are spiders so um i don't know if it comes with this pack but you can get the creepy crawly lot trait and that's what most of the areas in jungle adventure have here we go oh we're level seven. Oh dear look at his needs they're not too good although i did just realize it's like Half, it's 1 a.m. nearly, so, damn. Uh, how much is that worth? 42 simoleons. Wait, what? Oh, it's counterfeit. I am the bad influence. I'm the bad 
I didn't fl Wow. <laughs> the cheek of it from Rachel. Wow. <laughs> <coughs> I want my tea to cool down. I should get tired. <laughs> we are getting this done. Everything's going swimmingly. Although our water's just been turned off. But that's fine. That just means we have less bills to pay in the long run. Fill the bowl. Feed yourself. Because dogs always come first. You must always feed your pets before yourself. <laughs> okay. We're going to eat. Maybe play fetch or something. Would be good. Um, where's that ball gone? There you go. Are you really going to throw that in the house? Sergio. That's wonderful that you had a good time. Of course. <laughs> okay. Let's play. Because that will actually get that up. And i want to make sure that she's okay so we'll give her one of these wellness boosts all right our fun is going up oh my god okay let's see if we can make any you know get some of these artifacts to be worth a bit more that is what we desperately need. We really need these, you know, to get one of those hidden gems where it's worth thousands. Like we got the one that was worth 10,000 smolians. That was crazy. But I am wondering if this should just evolve, this, this uh, making money scenario should just evolve so that they're earning what happened to the stove there wasn't a stove in this lot um in this lot there just wasn't one uh put that in your inventory bess ha <laughs> not a chance let's refine a crystal ruby oh is this where we can do that insert a crystal so maybe if we refine a crystal put that in our inventory um do we just not have one of the bases i have no idea let's get him to pee we'll continue going through all of these because well how did the sims team miss that i have no idea the sim it's amazing what the sims team have missed over the years in fairness so yeah it's fine it's it's a workish kitchen it works we can eat in it that's all that counts oh the bats just got us come on keep going dude you got this let's uh authenticate this so that we can so it's worth 61 unauthenticated and it's worth 238 beautiful still more to go oh my god so this one's worth 61 as well let's see how much our inventory is currently worth if i were just to sell everything that we have i'm not going to but i'm just curious so twelve thousand well twelve and a half thousand simoleons is what our inventory is currently worth you are really inspiring me to play jungle adventures now that's fantastic it's a really fun one to do um 
And I love the idea that you've had about getting, you know, the child that he has to be a... Um, teacher or something and then they can uh then they can just like get him to then we can get the child to come and do uh weekends or whatever over here i think that's a really nice idea to do some jungle adventures That's worth 662. Okay, let's get him to sort out some of his needs. Where's the doggy? Oh, the doggy wants some love. The doggy wants a friend. Oh, needs to go potty. Go potty then. Nice. He went poopy. Throw that away before the dog ends up eating it because, ugh. Oh, really? You're licking up your urine. No, bad puppy. This is like the first time we're telling off the dog. I have to say, like the first time. Tell the dog off, dude. Wow, this dog knows how to get out of trouble. You don't need to go to sleep yet. You can authenticate another one. She wants to make puppies, she does. Oh, he's missing home again. Oh dear. Uh, continue authenticating please, and thank you. Blimey. Um, pets are adorable, but also completely disgusting. Well, just in li real life then. <laughs> the Sims team captured them perfectly. Uh, that one's worth 300. And I think we've got one more, but we'll get him to go to bed now. Oh. I can't believe I've streamed for so long. I think this is the longest I've ever streamed for. Two hours and 37 minutes. No, tell a lie. I did an autism awareness stream about five years ago, it must have been. And it was a 24 hour stream. And it was the most grueling thing I've ever done. Hey, Kieran, how are you doing, bud? Uh, we are playing Jungle Adventures and we're trying to make one million simoleons with Jungle Adventures and it's not working. Um, so yeah, I did this autism awareness stream and it was 24 hours. We took my computer over to my mum's house. Tom had the time off work, so he had just the kids. And it was so hard like it was the hardest thing I've ever done I have to say um I would rather go through birth again for a fourth time than do a 24-hour stream again it was awful and I don't know if you've ever been on the computer for that long I actually ended up stopping at 20 hours uh, because I was falling asleep on stream. Um, so I didn't survive it, but I did raise money for um, a charity that's quite close to my heart because Owen, uh, my boy, he does, of course, have additional needs like that. So he has autism. Um, but yeah, it was it was really, really, really hard. Um, and as I said, I would rather go through birth again than do the stream, a 24-hour stream. Uh, listen to classical. I couldn't make it through without sleeping yeah 
So this is going to sound crazy. I know we're friends and all, but well, okay, here it goes. I have a crush on you, phew. Okay, it's out there. Um, so would you want to go out with me sometime? You're super cool. I really want to hang out with you more. Oh my God. Oh my God, I stayed up with you the way. Yes, you did. <laughs> Oh, uh, you've been through me through some grueling times. Let's go for that. To make relics, you need the, a base top and crystal and be level seven. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay, so what level are we now of the archaeology? So we are level seven now. So we need to get the rest of the pieces to do that. I thought he wanted to go on a date with us. Where's he gone? I don't understand, dude. He's really annoying me. <laughs> if I invite him to come on with us, what's that going to do? Does that cost us money? Oh, okay. So, wow, really? That's so awesome. Oh, I'm so happy. I would have, I worked the, up the courage to ask. Let me know what works for you and we'll go out. Oh, okay. But why can't I ask him out on a date then? It doesn't always work, ask him out. But I can't. Right, let's, I've invited him to join us on the vacation, so here he is. Um, let's flirt, I'm gonna throw in a flirt straight away. I know he's non-flirty. But, okay, let's see. Throw it in there. Come on, dude. I mean, if we can start woohooing, that'll be fantastic for our fun levels. <laughs> or you could go on a day to your uh, vacation rental lot. I don't know what's going on. What's going on? Okay, he's unflirty, but he likes the flirting, so perfect. Let's ask to go on a date. And we'll go to the bar and go on a date. Do you know what? We haven't been to the museum actually yet, so let's go to the museum. You know, let's change it up a wee bit and all that. <laughs> Oh my God. Whew. <laughs> okay. So we need to both be flirty at the same time. We need to sit and talk to the date. So let's discuss interests and sit together. Come on, come over and chat with me, Sergio. I'm sorry, but the dog has to come with us. I think it's just right. Let's ask a risky question. Let's ask if he's single. We're just gonna, we can do a little bit of snuggling if he will allow. <coughs> Excuse me. The uh, museum would be a cute day. It's, it's nice. It's a little bit different. We've been to the uh, bar more than a few times. So I definitely think we need to shake it up a little bit. Oh my God, that's so cute. <laughs> yes. Okay. Let's see. How can we make a move here we go 
Get your moves in there. You can do this. I believe in you. Oh, the liking it. Oh, whisper some sweet nothings and tickle mercilessly. I love a good tickling. <laughs> okay. Oh, they're whispering some sweet nothings. <laughs> oh look our dog's getting excited looking there as well <laughs> okay um ask to be boyfriend there it is oh yes oh I love that okay we haven't got them both romantic yet. Why? Let's do inside joke. Tell a funny joke. And joke about old times. Why haven't we got them both flirty at the same time? However, we have got a gold, so yeah. I want to get the dogs at uh, the dogs get these guys in here to view some stuff oh here we go we can view that together because we're at a museum I feel like we should actually view things do you know what I mean you don't go to a museum just sit outside on a bench talking you go view the things in there and as we can do that together that's even better all right oh my god if this makes anyone feel sick, let me know. Oh my God. <laughs> That's really weird. Oh, I love that. Uh, have a deep conversation and then have... Let's go around here. There's more items in here. Let's go view that together. Oh, look, there's one of the plates that like that. I found one of these plates and it was worth 10,000 simoleons. Ah, oh, we should be a kleptomaniac. He's a freegan. Okay. Yeah, we finished viewing that. All right, guys. Go away. We're on a date. Oh, that's pretty. Let's go view that together. Where'd you go, dude? Where's our date gone? Okay. Um, I think we've viewed enough things. Let's have a deep conversation. And um, I wanna use the computer quickly as well while we're here. Uh, where's the deep conversation? There it is. Now I'm hoping we can buy some items, order. Um, okay, I want to order the items we need for this place. Purchase gifts? Surely we can buy like water in a can and things like that. The Simray. Wow. Can we not buy any like gear? from here that's pants if we can't that's the climbing gear oh man oh that's really annoying that that's the case okay I really want them to have their first kiss I also am going to Do that. 
let's what's out here go here together this is quite a cute little like spot if I can get them to do what I want them to do where's he gone where are you Sergio there you are and have a fast kiss in such a beautiful little spot i think that's really really nice you just see chloe like run across the screen so they have had their first kiss as well oh look at that oh i'm so proud of them <laughs> and then just going for a kiss what are you doing chloe you're like he's my owner mine you cannot have him okay we're flirty. He's still not flirty. Okay, let's get them to... Oops. Uh, we still need to finish the date. Let's do a sexy pose. Um, kiss cheek. Be enticing. Let's try and get... Ah, uh, there we go. We got 10 out of 10. Oh, we can give him a massage as well. He's really getting in there, isn't he? Right, at least we'll be able to get our fun up really easily now. Can I end the day? I just want to end the day. Oh, it finishes in 30 minutes. Okay. Oh, we're viewing the collection. There we go. Right, let's head home then. And maybe we can get them to woohoo or something. They've had a really successful day. And they are here together, so you know they can do that. They can they can have a little bit of a woohoo. Oh, she's a daddy's girl. The dog really is. <laughs> um, okay, so let's go woohoo with Sergio. I love this cup. It sits so nicely in your hands. It's like perfect for when you're uh, when you get in from the cold and whatnot. Um, yeah, it is ideal. Look at that! Right, they're, they're gonna do their thing. We should probably fill that bow up as well. God, she eats so much food. <clears throat> we do need to get back out and finish doing some more uh, looking for items. <clears throat> Perfect. Okay, he needs to sleep and stuff. I'm hoping that even though we've got him here, yeah, it still makes time go fast. Don't you dare pee on the sofa. Don't you dare do that, girl. <laughs> okay, uh, let, I saw it there. Ask to go potty. Um, let's get him to have, let's get him to serve some dinner. Use the toilet. And take a shower. The rude way. <laughs> no, let's not do that. Let's uh, get him to just take a shower. I don't want him to use all his energy up when we need to go. Oh. Oh, baby. It's sleepy time for you. Oh. Oh. Oh, 
okay so we just had Luna come in I'll have to make sure I keep my volume down a little bit more um daddy is now just putting her back to sleep uh, Emma, I'm back after having a break in my bedroom as my lock broke. I miss much. Uh, well, we have a boyfriend now. Sergio is on holiday with us. Let's stick that in the fridge. We got a bunch of... We've just been on a date as well. Oh no, let's repair that. We want to go ahead and make sure we get a bunch uh, more of this done. Make sure everything's done. Just some bedroom magic. Oh, and yes, of course, he had his first ever woohoo. It was very romantic. <laughs> yeah, of course, everyone's just having a natter in the bathroom. As you do. At least Sergio's getting on with um, our doggy. I think that's quite a uh, important thing. Let's extract that. I <laughs> think you miss all the good stuff. Oh, he just blew a kiss. That's really sweet. I have uh, so many moderators all of a sudden now, which is fantastic. So any little hiccups in the chat and stuff can be picked up quite quickly. I don't know what's going on with that. It doesn't seem to be doing anything. Okay, so let's do it on that one then. He's going to need to go to bed. God damn it. It looks like she is dirty, which isn't good. What is he extracting from these? Okay, right now he's done all of those. Let's see if these are worth any more, like a decent amount. Because we had it up to 12 and a half, didn't we? I think I had those included, didn't I? So it's now up to 13 and a half from having done that. That's, that's not great. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, was the frog included in that? It must have been. Yeah, it was. Oh my god. Okay, so let's get him to go sleep and we'll go on another travel. We're gonna have likes classical music? Yeah, sure. We're gonna have to go on another dig. Go to sleep. Oh, turn the music off and go to sleep. There we go. Come on, right. We can get them. We can do this, it's all good. Mm. Right, <clears throat> I think I might call it now actually because we've been going for three hours. Well, literally two minutes off three hours. I think it's been a really successful stream. We have got a lot done in this game so far. Um, we've we've got we got the ten thousand at the beginning, so we're up to about twenty. Uh, three and a half thousand simoleons in total which isn't too bad we've got a dog as well Chloe um, and a boyfriend he's go we've agreed that he's going to adopt so he'll probably do that when he ages up into an adult because I want to get a child or a teenager but we'll decide that in the next stream what we actually get so I don't really want to age him up I don't really want to adopt a child and for another 11 days ideally um obviously we have very soon starting for the channel the through the ages channel 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 <laughs> we have of course starting on the channel through the ages challenge which i am building myself that is on my website gamingshire.com we are starting with 
the Stone Age and we go through all of the different eras. It combines the History Challenge, the Great British Sim Challenge, the Decades Challenge, the um, um, Generations Challenge, Rags to Riches. It takes so many of these amazing challenges, puts them all in together but also adds in storylines and events. So they're, they're gonna be so much fun. Um, I'm currently recording the Stone Age. So make sure you check that out when it finally comes. Um, there's also tutorials and everything Sims related on the website gamingshire.com. So there's so much more for you to check out. So please make sure you do. As always, make sure you check out Erin the Rescue Simmer, who is not only an amazing lady, but she is also an amazing YouTuber with very unique content. Um, I really want to thank, we'll go back up to the top of the chat to make sure no one's missed, although we had quite a small group in today. We had Rachel, thank you so much. Tom, my better half, Emma, we had quite a few bots pop into the chat today. Um, and we had Erin. So thank you all for commenting and coming in. I think all of you are pretty much moderators now. Um, but yeah, it's, it's been a really nice and chilled out stream. For, you can see that just by the fact I managed to stream for three hours. I've been sat here the entire time. Um, so yeah. Make sure you like and subscribe. Everyone lurking out there, if you want to check out more, go ahead. Right, I think that's enough of our farewells. I will miss you until the next stream. That could be any day. <laughs> right, bye guys.